Hello, it's John Bauman again. We're going to do a calculation of average tax rates and we're also going to calculate the actual amount of taxes paid by people in these uh, hypothetical brackets. Um, of course, the actual rates are different from these and you can see them in our textbook. The numbers here are small and I'm going to keep them simple but the, uh, to calculate the total amount of tax paid and the average tax rates is done the exact same way. Just uh, bigger numbers and a little bit different uh, tax rates. So if you look at the, ta the table here you can see that a person earning between zero and a hundred dollars is going to pay zero percent. So if you earn ten dollars or fifty dollars or ninety nine dollars or a hundred dollars you're going to pay zero percent. Anybody earning over $100 is going to pay 10%. Now, that person is going to pay 10% only over any amount, uh, only over um, any amount that's greater than $100. So, uh, we're going to look at that in just a second with the calculation. Anybody earning between $300 or $300, $400, $500, up to $800 is going to pay a marginal tax rate of 25%. $800 and higher, the rate is 40%. So here we have four examples. One person earns $50 and then the next person $200, $500 and $1,000. You can pause the video at this point and see if you can calculate on your own what kind of tax amount each person pays and then also calculate the average tax rate. So let's start with the easy one, the person earning $50. Well, you can see that the person is in the 0% tax bracket because the tax amount here is between 0 and $100, and that's 0%. So the person is just going to pay 0% of $50, and of course that's $0. Now, if you take 0 as a percentage of the total amount of income of that person, that gives you the average tax rate, and that's also 0%. So the answer here is, of course, is $0 and 0%. Now let's take a look at example 2. The person earns $200. Now that person, of course, is in the second bracket, the one between $100 and $300, and pays 10% in marginal tax. But the first $100 is still taxed at 0% because you got to work your way up to the bracket. So the first $100 is still $0, of course. And then the, the any additional amount above that. So, well, there's $100 left after that first $100. And that's taxed at 10%. So $100 times 10%, that's, of course, $10. And that's the total tax paid by this person. So nothing over the first $100, 10% over the next $100, and the total tax. So, it's, so these two have to add up to 200 total for the total amount of income. The total tax paid is $10. Now if you take 10 and you divide it by the total income of that person, $200, you get 5%. So 5% uh, doesn't... 5%. Doesn't, uh, there's no room there. <laughs> uh, and that's that person's average tax rate. Now let's take a look at a person earning $500 per year. The first $100 is still free. You still pay 0%. Again, you've got to work your way up the bracket. So the first $100 is 0%. And of course, that's $0. And then the, there's $200 in the next bracket. And that's taxed at 10%, so that's going to be $20. And then how much money is left for that $500 income person? Well, there's going to be $200 left, because the total has to add up to $500. And that, that any amount over $300 is taxed at 25%, according to that table that we're using. And $200 times 25%, that is one-fourth of $200, that's $50. So that is our total, so the total amount of income, it's got to add all, everything's got to add up to $500. And the total amount of tax, now let's add that up, is $70. 
So that's the total amount of tax paid, and that means that the average tax rate of this person is going to be 70 divided by $500, which comes out to 14% if you divide 70 divided by 500. And let's take a look at our last example, example 4, person is earning $1,000. Again, we got to start uh, with the first bracket. That person is still going to pay $100 times 0%. So that's 0. And then the next bracket has $200 in it. So $200 times 10%. That's 20. And then the, the next bracket has $500 in it, between $300 and $800. And that is at 25%. So that's $125. And then how much money is left over? Well, the person has already paid taxes over the first 800, 100, 200, and 500. So there's $200 left. And that amount says any, any amount $800 or higher is taxed at 40%. So that additional $200 is taxed at 40%, and that is $80. And if you add them all up, you get a total of 225. So that's the total tax that that person pays that earns $1,000. And if you take 225 and you divide it by the total income of that person, $1,000, of course you get 22.5%, and that's the person's average tax rate.